Let's see. I think there might be an assault or heavy. Oh, it's a madcap. I want that. I want that. Please, 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 Andre. Please, Andre. Please, Andre. Please, Andre. Oh, no, no, no. This is bad. This is very, Stevie very bad. It's a trap. It's a trap. Everyone fall back. Hello, welcome back. Uh, I hope you all had a great day. We are back with the liberation of Port Arthur. Operation 3 it is. Fighting for Effendale, one of the major cities or larger cities on the planet. Um, this is our fifth operation. We are closing in on the end. Um, in this mission we gotta defend a base we captured earlier. Um, which not our unit did do, but apparently another unit. So... Yeah, let's don't wait for too long. Uh, yeah, one or two new additions to our um, group of mech warriors. We got Vixen from the market, which is basically a uh, pretty good overall mech warrior coming at the rank of elite. And we got Goblin, which is a veteran. Also pretty good to be built upon. I mean, the jumping is not really needed as we don't really use it. But who knows, who knows. Let's go. All right, let's go. She rush over to the base we need to protect, and we see from there. This is, by the way, the third time I'm trying this. This is um, not that easy. Also, I have the confession to make. Uh, I don't know how to fuck use the mine layer. I, 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 I never. I don't know. It's like you cannot use these buttons to lay mines. There, there must be some kind of hotkey because you cannot like unfold it like sometimes in Command and Conquest or something. And obviously doesn't lay mines by itself by just moving around or staying on the tile. I just don't get it really. I don't know how to use a mine layer. If anybody knows, please write a comment. <laughs> please. I beg you. Because after all those years I really would like to know. <laughs> Ah, that's a lot of mechs, yeah. <laughs> a lot of, lot of mechs, and I know what's coming. And I'm not gonna spoil it, but it's gonna hurt. <laughs> On my first attempt, I thought this is probably in a breeze because of my pretty well set up mechs and eight of them, of the heavy ones and mediums. But uh, no. The game went full uh, on, um, hey bro, no. <laughs> Actually, let's make a gap here. I got an idea. Just realized what maybe might help me. Okay, I mean these never were my problem. These for fire starters always die pretty much in seconds. This is Falcon, enemy mech destroyed. Son of a bitch. A huge problem is actually the next mech wave that's coming. Let's have a quick scan where they are. Yeah, these grouped up. Because these two groups basically uh, join together and attack from this front. And there's uh, three hunchbacks in them. <laughs> With AC-20s. And these guys always one-shot my mechs. I don't know, they really like to do that. Um, it was horrible. Hunter got killed. Goblin got killed. They just one-shot the cockpits, I don't know. It's a... Uh, welcome to hard mode. <laughs> That's why I never recommended playing it on hard, because... It's just an endless spiral of suffering, replaying missions, until you get lucky RNG. And... yeah. <laughs> but admittedly, I always forgot the, that I got artillery strikes in the runs before this, so this time I'm gonna definitely try to... ...utilize those. Reporting new also, there's like a larger group of Rommel tanks coming from the other side, which are also pretty annoyingly dangerous. Yeah, those artillery strikes might actually help a bit. I have an 
Uh, timing. I'm, I'm a little bit uh, undecisive if I wanna go for the Romans or the Max first, but I think I have to do the Max first. Maybe I should have saved the artillery strikes for now. Let's try to get some of the smaller ones before we can focus on the largest. Oh, that's pretty nice. They're instantly puffing away. I'm not getting close to these. I mean, they will try to rush in, but I'm pretty much just gonna try to stay as far away from them as possible. Oh yeah, that's bad actually. Oh, they're hitting the HQ. That's really bad. Oh, I almost lost the mission over there. Now back to that hunchbacks. I think he didn't have a lucky shot yet, which was pretty much my rescue. He's trying though, he's trying. No, we can't. Yeah, the Centurion also had like an AC-10 I think or something like that. Phew. Oh no, I thought he was dead. Come on guys, you can do it. I have the target. Okay, now also the base turrets are attacking him again, which is good. Alright, so far so bad. <laughs> Falcon almost died. But she's still... No, oh, she lost all of her weapons. Holy shit, three extreme range PPCs gone, that's like 20k. Ah. Also, she's pretty useless for the rest of the mission. We were also not... I mean, these two are awesome, but uh, we were really unlucky salvage-wise overall. I think there was another repair point over here, right? Yeah. Let's get those two over here. Ah, wish there was a double click to move to them immediately. Is he repairing? No. Why are you not repairing? Yes, sir. Maybe I should have taken AC 10s or 20s myself. Then again, I sold a lot of them off because I thought I don't use them. Okay, I'm on it. So I don't think I could have feel it enough to make it worthwhile. Executing your order. Yeah, this went really bad overall. This is really concerning. If they just rush the base, I'm pretty much done for. So yeah, let's wait for the next wave. This is Hunter. Sir, I can't get through here.
that air coming from the south this time. And again, it's hunchbacks. Jesus, mother, <clears throat> mother of loving God. Why does this game do this to me? And they are coming from a really bad position. Hold on. Maybe I can lure them into the gas tanks. I have fuel tanks over here. That would help immensely. Because they come from a really bad spot. For me, that is to fight them. Come on guys, you wanna fight me, don't you? No, they're just... Come on, they're rushing the HQ. This is not fun. Come on, let me be lucky. Let me be lucky, please. Kill them off. I think that one lost his AC20, so I should be good. Yeah, holy... Hopefully they don't know how to shoot at the fuel tanks. <laughs> ah, that's a catapult. Oh, they didn't realize that. So it was another LM. Fitted so well into them. Yeah, I'm gonna try to move them over to the repair bay. Oh, that was it. Nice. But I lost a lot of components, and overall, this was really bad. But at least I did it in a third attempt, and only 2000 RPs lost in payment. So that's not too bad. But man, those lost components, they hurt. Uh, let's see if we got any more salvage. Oh yeah, at least two of the hunchbacks. And two catapults. Okay, I mean, Maguire said was kind of lucky. Catapults are really good in my opinion. In this game. But yeah, yeah, yeah I know. We need to repair. <laughs> I was kind of confused. I wanted to repair it, but uh, never mind. Never mind. I don't know where my, my mind was in that thing. Maybe I was thinking like, what kind of setup I want to do. <laughs> that was basically what went to my mind. Now that I lost so much of the good stuff. Uh, I mean, it's, it's even more firepower to be honest, so probably not that bad. But still hurts to have lost those awesome, awesome weapons. I think we're just gonna leave the rest as is. Oh. Ah, yeah, hold on. I need to clear out some of the components from the max we captured. Uh, this one? It's irritating when it shows like payload, but it's basically just broken guns. No, we don't repair them for sure. We don't. What do they have? Okay, that's just the jump. That's just the jump jets. That one, yeah, these we wanted. These also. Uh, okay. Jump jets again. Nothing here. This one. This one probably. These heavy auto cans. So painful. But hold on, we we're gonna use actually Ah oh no, that's first generation hunchback. I thought it was the clan hunchbacks, but never mind. Didn't really pay attention there. Did I? Okay. Depending on what tonnage we got available, I might even take in those two catapults, so I just leave them in for now. <coughs> Let's quickly have a look at the mission briefing. Okay, this is an attack mission as it seems. Uh, we need to extract afterwards. 
But that's really close by though, that shouldn't be too much of a problem. Going through that city might actually be interesting. This also seems to be fortified. Probably if we circle around completely that would be our best choice of action. There might be salvage over here. <laughs> is it the greed that leads us or is it the common sense? That's the good question. But we have 450, 450 is actually less than before. Let's first take our main group, which I would call these four, and him probably. Um, if we take two more catapults, that's like 80, 90, and we got 60 left. No, it just doesn't fit by five tons. But this one was too much already. Uh, let's see, let's see, let's see. Ah, I actually think maybe. No, 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 no. I'm probably gonna take those two catapults. This is Scarab. This one. I'm gonna unload this one for now. Oh no, I might need that. Oh my god, that was stone. Okay, never mind. What am I doing? Okay, let's see how many of those pulse lasers we can fit. Yeah, I'm pretty happy with that. That's some nice firepowers. Actually, it's 7.5 damage every two seconds. That it's not to be underestimated. Uh, this is scarab. scarab for yeah, scarab webs. And then we need to refit the centurion. I just uh, <laughs> unfitted for no apparent reason. What the fuck were I doing? I also get the large pulse laser. One PPC. Let's take that sensor out for now. To have a better weight overview. Uh, maybe three of those. Yeah. Uh, hold on, ultra auto can. When did I give that? So I took the PPC. My bad. I wanted the PPC. Let's take this one out again. Let's see. Let's see. Oh, okay. Let's look for something. Yeah, that that's guess that works. All right, we should be good to go. A lot of PPC power on our side, but that's nice alpha strike damage. And actually, could take another centurion. Mm, then again, nah, 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 nah. I'm gonna. Stay with my main guys. All right, let's go. All right, let's go. Uh, I try to be transparent as possible, as much as transparent as possible. This is also the second attempt on this mission. The first one, I in theory finished the mission and everything was fine. I could have just gone to the next one, but uh, my losses were really high in the end and. Yeah, I didn't want to have that. I lost one of the mech warriors in the lead one completely. You might have noticed that there's like a little shuffling in the um, mech setup from the actual briefing. That's because I just clicked them in this time quickly. And it was not about the route I took was pretty good. Like the left side was as good as expected, like relatively safe. Not too much fighting in the city area. But, um, yeah. Things, how they unfolded, were very unpleasant. <laughs> but just in the last few uh, minutes of the mission. Before that, it was really okay. Okay. 
Falcon here, sir. There's a new sensor contact. Yes, sir. Yeah, fighting catapults in the city is not the best area because they can shoot over the buildings with their LMs, but you cannot directly hit them with your lasers and PPCs. I mean, my setup is not the best to fight them in the city. Let's be real. There's been no salvage for us. Let's take some time and quickly take out those toads before we keep approaching. Let's quickly move in. I think there's another catapult yeah, right inside. As soon as I'm in the cannon turrets, I'm not a problem anymore. Because they cannot keep shooting me. Just quickly take over the turret control. And they will immensely help us killing off that last catapult. I think there was a counter strike coming now, yeah. It's actually... Tried to get that. But I don't know if that's the right timing, but... Might work. Very good, sir. Well, at least a bit late. And there's the steam again. <laughs> With the notifications. Ah. Yes, sir. Let's just quickly keep on repairing before they hit us. I mean, they are already there, but they need to fight through the turrets first. Maybe even we might be lucky and one of the guys is taken out by one of the turrets. Because those cannon turrets, they can actually deal quite some damage. And as they are walking right through them. Uh, let's wait for them to get around. They take quite a beating on their way in. That was pretty good, luckily. Uh, let's cheese it. Why take an extra risk? Should get a little closer though so more of my guys can fire at him. There we go, just like that. Did I get any of them? Yeah, one at least. It's always hard to get salvage with these high caliber guns I'm using. Oh, was there anything else to capture? No. This forward base is pretty nice actually. Many turrets and nicely uh, arranged. Just quickly get in position here to fight those two catapults at the ridge. I didn't want to damage the bridge, that was why I placed the uh, artillery strike so strangely. I hope the uh, Dragamax actually walks through here, but I should have probably placed it more around here. That was pretty much a waste of an artillery strike, to be honest. But, well, that was still a little bit damage done. Also, armored variants, so I can just go for one another after another. It's close in some range, so the LRMs maybe won't work. 
So far, so good. That might actually been, yeah, so we should have one. Even though I did expect it to be this one, but this one exploded, I guess it's that one. Because it looked like we shot out the pilot, but maybe not. I will just try to quickly run through the tower controller somewhere over here ish. Because these missile turrets will also help me. Let's get all our guys in. I think there should be some kind of counter attack coming. At least last time there was. Let's take out the barracks. Show them what's popping. <laughs> Why their light ACs don't take, uh, don't make much of damage. The, the constant fire rate is pretty, pretty concerning. You might actually think of sending the awesome back for some repairs actually before I do the final part of the mission. Sadly, didn't do it last time, and I regretted it. <laughs> Let's quickly push him out of the turret range, control tower range. Or just destroy him, that's even better. Destroy the fault, not the turret. Thank you. Uh, let's finish the last defenders. Yeah, I'm not see him anymore. I think the last tour control tower was over here. Yeah. All these stupid, stupid LIM carriers. It's so annoying. That's actually more damage than I hoped for. Uh, let's quickly pull back. This is the building we need to destroy. I'm quickly gonna repair my guys, so I'll be right back once that is done. Alright, we are pretty much back in position. I just quickly killed that building. I almost overlooked those two component warehouses, uh, but wouldn't have been too bad. There was not too much interesting in it. I realized I also got one of those spies, so this is pretty much what's awaiting us. Uh, they damaged because I put my light artillery strike on them. The Mad Cat will now try to basically do us in. At least that's last time what he tried to do. So I'm gonna try to fall back a bit. I really would like to get that mech, but it's highly unlikely, I think. Let's try to catch him before he can fully retreat. To just see. Oh my god. Fuck. Uh, we also got him. Oh! Oh! Okay. Okay. Okay, I definitely want to finish this mission now. I'm 100% sure about that. No matter what happens, I'm gonna finish this mission. Uh, Falcon is looking pretty bad. But we're doing everything we can to save her right now. Sometimes they take a ridiculous amount of damage, almost. Oh, 
Oh, why? Oh my god, that was actually the fucking best possible outcome we just got. We got that mad cat with all of its weapons. This is insanely lucky. Insanely lucky. This is basically one of the strongest mechs in the game, the Mad Cat W version. This thing has weapons for days. Okay, I think I need to... As I need to extract all of mine, I'm gonna run back with these two to repair them, save some money. Well, this one will take forever <laughs> to get there, so... I'll be back once uh, this mission is finally finished. Alright, everyone is basically in position. We did it. We got insanely lucky. Insanely lucky and kept shot that mad cat. I'm so happy right now. This will oh, this will make a lot of shit easier. This thing is so powerful. So good. Let's have a look at it again. All that weapons. All that weapons. Cannot imagine that power. <laughs> uh, we definitely need to give Falcon a break on the next mission. She's almost dead, so basically she can be shot out of the cockpit even without actually killing, uh, like killing the max cockpit or whatever. And yeah, this was our two missions for this pack. I hope you enjoyed. Hope to see you back soon because we got a mad cat. <laughs> Enjoy your day. Thanks for coming by. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.